Hello, my name is Ben Lovegrove, and in this video, I'm going to list many of the companies involved in the field of urban air mobility and the aircraft in development. Urban air mobility is the term applied to VTOL, vertical takeoff and landing, and eVTOL, electric vertical takeoff and landing, vehicles designed to carry one or more people within or between cities. These new types of aircraft may be commercially piloted, privately piloted, or autonomous drones. They may carry passengers, be flown solo, or ferry medical supplies and other cargo or deliveries. But what's the demand? Why do we need another form of transport? We are all too familiar with the delays and frustrations caused by congestion on roads and railways and the strains placed upon our transport infrastructure. Roads and railways are expensive to build and maintain, and they can be very damaging to the environment. We've also grown accustomed to the idea that we have to switch to more sustainable and less polluting forms of energy consumption. And we also recognize there is a continuing and growing demand for personal and public transportation within and between our cities. People want safe, convenient, affordable transport powered by sustainable energy. Now it seems we've reached the point where all the necessary ingredients are in place to create a rapid period of growth in urban air mobility. The demand exists, the investment and the vision are in place, and the technology has advanced to a point where prototypes have been flown and tested. And so it is predicted that by 2025 we'll see the first viable flying taxis and airborne intercity shuttles and by 2050, they are likely to have become commonplace. There are now several viable aircraft ready to fly as urban air taxis, intercity commuter aircraft, and airport shuttles. What follows is a list of the companies involved in the development of these aircraft. Some of these companies are well-known global brands, and others are startups bringing innovations to the industry. If you think I've missed any, then please post a comment under this video and I will investigate. Below this video, the list includes the website of each company. And if I haven't included an image for any of the designs, it's because I haven't been given permission to do so. A cubed by Airbus with their Vahana. The Avia Innovations Hepard. Airbus Helicopters City Airbus. The Mobi by Airspace Experience Technologies, or Airspace X. The Astro Aerospace Elroy. Aurora's VTOL. Autoflight X's BAT 600. The Bartini Flying Car. The Beta Technologies Ava XC. Bell's Nexus. Boeing's Cargo Aerial Vehicle. The Carter Aviation Air Taxi. The DeLorean Aerospace DR7. Ombre's Ombre X E VTOL Division. The Hop Flight Venturi. The Hover Surf Drone Taxi. The Kitty Hawk Cora and the Kitty Hawk Flyer. Jaunt Air Mobility. Jetpack Aviation's Speeder. Jobby Aviation's Jobby S4. Carim Aircraft's Carim Butterfly, Lilium Aviation's Lilium Jet, Neoptera Aero's Eopta, NFT's eVTOL, The Opener Blackfly, The PALV Flying Car, Piasecki's eVTOL, Pipistrel Vertical Solutions, The Saberwing Draco 2 UAS, the Sikorsky VERT, Skyworks Global, the Terra Fugia TFX, the Top Flight Technologies Airborg H810K, the Transcend Air VY400, Uber's Air Taxis, the Urban Aeronautics City Hawk, Vimana's Autonomous Aerial Vehicles. The Volocopter VC200 and the Volocopter 2X. The XTI aircraft Trifan 600. The X Verdigo Aero PAT200. 
personal air taxi. Before we can all start booking air taxis on our apps, there are still some big obstacles to overcome. Safety is the primary concern, but there are also challenges in the areas of infrastructure and noise. Stability in the air is another. No one wants to take a ride in an air taxi that's being buffeted by gusts between the skyscrapers. Then of course there are things like battery power, vehicle separation, takeoff and landing sites, and so on. But as always, where there's a will, there's a way. So while our cities have yet to take on the appearance of Los Angeles in Blade Runner, there's a good chance that you may be able to take a ride in an air taxi in the next 10 years. You or some of your children and your grandchildren will be piloting these aircraft, while others will be autonomous air vehicles, i.e. passenger drones. I'll soon be creating more videos about specific aircraft types, so subscribe to my channel and click the bell to be notified of the next upload. In the meantime, please post a comment below with any questions or ideas. How do you think this industry will evolve? Which designs will succeed and why? Please share this video within the aviation community in order to provoke more debate and ideas.